Okay, they're going to run after me wherever I go because that's what they do whenever I come out. Whenever they see me, they just run after me. Yeah, okay, okay. We get the point. All right, fine. I'll give you I'll give you something to eat. Hey, hey. Okay, not all at once. Though. They decided this is a better place to sleep. Ladies, this ate your coop. And this ain't your bedroom. Gross. Look what you did to my air condition. Yes. 12 o'clock. You should be sleeping in your coop. Uh-huh. I hear, I hear. Good night. All right, everyone. Beautiful day. These chickens gotta go. They are, they just gotta go. They are going up to the big coop today. You hear me, ladies? Up to the big coop. They're starting to crow in the morning and they are getting my quail hutch all filthy. Pooping all over it, huh? Is that, is that how we behave? Hi, good morning. Today is moving day. These ladies, men actually, are starting to crow in the morning and my neighbors live right there, are not very happy with it. So they are now moving to the big chicken coop. I'm gonna put them in a temporary enclosure and now we're gonna try to catch them. Hey, hey. Ah. It's okay. Come <laughs> okay, we're all out here. Family time. Hi, pops. And Brachel and Arla were catching the pullets, and they are going to be in this enclosure in the big coop. And the little babies that were in here, Penguin and the other chick, graduated to this coop. See, there they are. Penguin, you gonna say hi? Yeah, you can't really see her, she's dark. But she's there. Okay, one last one to catch. One last one to chat, catch. Oops. No, no, no. Mami, five more can do. Can, 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 can. Let's make sure they don't get jump out. Wait, wait, wait. 
Okay. No, 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 no. I keep. Eve, <laughs> <laughs> mommy, Eve. Okay, so hold her. You hold her, and we'll go to the coop. Very nice. But I let, I let it, I let it. No, no. Okay, you're taking her up. Maybe. Okay, they are now coming out of their coop. They're coming to check out their new friends. They are their new friends, safe in their enclosure. And let's see. Let's see who's gonna come check them out first. That white, that white one that's coming closest to them, he's my alpha male. So he's gonna be the first no, I guess not. They're not interesting. Not interesting. A turkey? She's curious. Turkey no one's me. curious. <laughs> Never saw a turkey before. Mom. They're brothers, they're your brothers. You have the same moms. No, no one's interested. No one's interested. Look at everyone's just like standing there. No one's being the first one to greet each other. We'll come back tomorrow. Okay, today's a special day. We are going to let the pullets out of their little enclosure. They've been segregated. And now look at this. Every time we come out, Shugi's the first one to greet us. Here's the, hey Shugi, good morning. Good morning, Shugi. He is the only male who knows how to get out from behind the coop. <laughs> right, yeah. So, and all the hens as well know how to get out. So he's their protector. He makes sure they're safe outside. He comes to see every person and then he walks us back and he makes sure everyone's okay. And then he'll go behind us make sure that everything's okay <laughs> and he's checking out for his ladies that they come out behind the coop is it an alleyway that all your little ones could come out and they hang out under this tree here's one there's another one inside can you see him yeah we know you're here you're watching them there is one inside there's another one. This is our favorite tree. And he's gonna make sure one's okay. All right, that was our chicken update. <laughs> now we have our turkey update. Hey Kiwi, how you doing? She looks just fine. Babies are due any day, another day or two. <laughs> All right. These chickens are busy finishing off our Shabbos leftovers that we left them on Shabbos. And these are our pullets that they're so excited. You ready to come out? Okay, we're gonna get you out. I'm just gonna feed the chickens if they should have their own food first and then we'll take them out. Okay, coming in to check half an hour later. Chicken coop is empty. Empty. Let's go find the chicks. One, two. These are staying in a group. 
Okay, happy as can be. And there's one up there on the compost pile. You figured it out, huh? You figured it out, ladies. Best place ever, compost pile. So, these days we are not getting any leftovers from the Nevada kitchen, which as you know, unfortunately is closed. So, uh, our piles are sort of gonna start getting smaller. We're gonna flip them and I'll explain to you more how to do it and how you can do it in your own backyard. Make your own compost in earth. This is Kiwi, and these are her eggs. Let me show you. These are her eggs she's sitting on. And she just went to get some drink and water. She came right back on. She makes herself cozy again. And they should be born any day. And she gets really mad if you disturb her. Really, really mad. It's okay. Oh, yeah. One more broody surprise is yesterday when I came to get the eggs, Miss Thing was sitting here. She is broody as well. She's sitting on eggs. And she was sitting on only two eggs, so yesterday I added a whole bunch of eggs. And you see, these are the eggs. Hello, good morning. And she's really gentle. Really gentle, saw those eggs all under her. Usually broody chickens will, will peck at you, but she's not. She's really sweet. She's sitting in the in the place where they lay eggs. I don't know what that's called, a place where they lay eggs. Uh, you have to find a name for that. Anyway, this is the other side of their coop. They go straight in from their coop through the curtains, and I open the door from the back side. Have a good day, sweet thing. Yeah. All day she'll just sit and sit and sit. Hey, okay? for 21 days. We're around day four, so we'll keep an eye. Okay, so we have broody turkey down there. Broody chicken up there. 